بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو دس ویڈیو آن اوریکل ایپ ایکس وچ ول بی کورنگ سنگل سائن آن وی بی یوزنگ ملٹیپل اپلیکیشنس ٹو سوئچ بائی لاگ ان ونس اینڈ اٹ ول یوز دا سیم اتھینٹیکیشن بٹ اٹ شوڈ بی ہیونگ دا سیم اتھینٹیکیشن امنگ ڈفرنٹ اپلیکیشنس سو اٹس ناٹ پاسبل دیٹ ان ون یو ول ہیو کسٹم این ادر یو ول ہیو ایپ ایکس اور in third you have LDAP they should have same authentication and then you can switch between application so let's have a demo it will be really a nice feature a nice option you are looking for for a long time now let's move okay here is an application application one I have created two applications application one and application two so let's say in application one I have departments and in application two I have employees for example I'm just for the demo purpose I'm using this otherwise you can have finance HR application and self-service and you are going to switch or you have configuration setup application so you want to keep as a separate application it depends on your requirement so if I will see here I am going to switch to application 2 now when I am going to switch to application 2 it is asking me username and password while username and password is same right uh, in both ap applications so I move to now application 2 now I'm going back to application 1 and it is again asking me username and password so every time I need to enter our username and password I don't want this but my requirement is that once I will start any application any of this application one or two or three whatever I have the application so once I will log in then if I am switching from uh, uh, here or I am directly opening here the menu and opening the direct, the pa uh, direct page so let's say for example I am opening employees and it should open the employee screen right it shouldn't ask uh, the username and password every time okay so for this what we need to do for example I have uh, these application let me show you ERP ST stuff a double P so I have two applications right just I created for the demo purpose nothing much in this so I will go in the first application and this uh, shared components and then I have to go to authentication scheme because I have to set authentic and it is at the moment default apex so both should have uh, apex accounts right so in this I can click on this session sharing and if you see by default it is no sharing so I will be selecting workspace so within this workspace all those application which having type workspace sharing will share this feature okay now this is application one I have updated and now I am going to update the application two this is one way I will share the next as well there are two options there okay so here also I will enable workspace sharing okay that's it now let me close the existing instance and uh, session so I am now in application 2 right I will click application 1 that's it application 2 okay so it is having the same session it is sharing the session and if I will click departments okay if I will click employees that's it so now I don't need to log in so for example I will log out once let me do it again so this is my application 2 I am logging in my application 2 sign in this is application 2 now I am switching to application 1 without any login screen again right and then to this okay 
now let me log out from application one now this time i will be sign out and in this i have kept that after login you have to show certain url or page or application or whatever so this setting setting also i will show uh, let me go to application one now this is my application two and this is application one let me show over here Sorry. okay so this is i'm um, this time i'm logging in to the application one right and from here i will go to application two now right so same username and password okay uh, to do this uh, let's say you have to take a few things so i have entered the url like this so this is my navigation menu and here this is how we will be doing this so this is the url instead of page and down in the url target you have to write like this so this is my page 2 of application 27105 and this is my app session right and same way uh, i did for the in the application 2 and that the application number was different okay while in uh, the other part where i am just switching to the application not to a page right navigation bar which was there on uh, right side so here if you see what i am doing exactly same but here i have removed the page number so it will not open the page number it will go to the home page or you can put it one so it will open the uh, page one which is home page up to you right this is switching application and that the other one is the navigation to certain uh, report or page right so this is how you can have single sign on between uh, two applications or multiple applications and second option is in this let me show you that in the same authentication scheme i will be clicking the name and session sharing the same place if you see here this is not sharing this is workspace sharing and here there is a custom so in the custom you can see you can keep this uh, blank it will automatically take it and this cookie domain for example i am just saying my domain is sorry uh, erp stuff so in this both application or any other application which will have the cookie domain erp stuff then it will share the authentication among those applications right so this is how browser will keep the cookies and it will take the session details and it will allow you to log in right this option secure if you have https you have to keep it on if http then you have to keep it off if you have ssl configured you have to keep it on for extra security but for http you can keep it or you will have to keep it off right this is how you can configure single sign on so this is my let's try this one as well this is my application number one four right now let me try the second application which is this one and this session because earlier i was sharing the workspace application and now custom so same this one I haven't enabled this secure, but you can enable it. I haven't entered anything in the cookie path. So now let me close this one, right? And open this one. Okay. This is my application two. I'm working in application two. Let me go to application one. Okay. So now this time that uh, domain name, which we are sharing, in that those settings that is taking care right okay now 
I think in application one, I have setting that it sh when I am going to log out, it should go to shared components. Same authentication scheme, this one. And if I will go down, here it is. Post logout URL. So you can use this one. So I've just uh, used my portal URL to uh, open. So otherwise I will keep it like this home page. So it will not be going to erpstuff.com. Okay. So let me show you this is where is my application one. It was in application one. Now I'm going to log out. 